Talent, and today we will be exploring the topic of dust. Today we have two third grade students here to give us their thoughts about the mystery of dust. First, let's meet our students. Hello, my name is Laura. And my name is Tessa. And what in the world is dust? Well, that's what we're here to figure out today. So, Laura, what do you think dust is? Hmm, dust. Well, I think dust is that tiny little fuzzy stuff that always goes up your nose and makes you sneeze. Yeah, I know, right? Now, next question is for Tessa. Where do you think dust comes from? I think it comes from the floor. Like when you go up in the attic and it gets stuck in your shoe. But I think someone once told me that it comes from your dead skin. So gross. Ew, that is so gross. I hope none of it's my skin. Okay, next question. This one's for Laura. How do you think dust gets from place to place? I think the wind blows it around or when people move around, they move the dust around from place to place. Good point, Alora. Now, Tessa, do you think dust can never go away? Yeah, I think it will go away. All you have to do is wash it down the drain so that way it will turn into sand on the bottom of the ocean. Interesting thought, Tessa. Now, girls. Have you ever thought of dust coming from another place? Huh? Aww. That's right, girls. There's actually another type of dust that comes from the desert. You mean like the tiny little pieces of sand? Yeah, I know what you mean. The, ti the tiny dust pieces that flow around in the air like a sandstorm. That's exactly right, Tessa. Now, dust does come from the desert, and it travels around the world by the wind. Crazy, right? Well, that's all the time we have for today. I hope you enjoy the rest of your journey through the world of desert dust. Good luck!